Hello, my name is Ketar Diaz Vera, and this is my first speaking project. Um, spending Valentine's Day. Um, I think there are many ways you can spend Valentine's Day. Uh, for example, relaxing at home, watching a movie or stuff like that. Going to the beach, it's more like for family but or for friends. But I think also it's a good ex um, experience to, to have with your partner or with your friends or family. Going to dinner, I think it's a very like romantic stuff because you can um, converse and you can talk about things you like. Mm, going for bowling, I think it's also a good way of spending Valentine's Day more with your friends than with your partner, but it can also be with your with your par partner. Um, going to the cinema, it's very classical. I mean, it's like sort of romantic and stuff like that. Uh, going to the fair or going somewhere you like, it's um, a good way of spending Valentine's Day too. Board games, like for example, being at your home and, and playing board games, things like that. I think it's also a good way of spending Valentine's Day because you have fun with the people you, you like, uh, with the person you like. And uh, going for parties, it's very, very classical to make parties at Valentine's Day. So I, most of the time they're fun and they are enjoyable. And also going for, um, I don't know, getting out somewhere to, to enjoy this, this day. It's, it's amazing, I think. Uh, what kind of person would each sort of celebration be suitable for? Like for people who want to, uh, I don't know, the ones who want to relax in, your, in their houses, I think it's more like for people who are calm, who don't like the stress of life every, t every day and who just want to be at home, watching movies, eating ice cream, doing stuff like that. Uh, going to the beach is more like for friends, family, but it also can be with your partner and it's very enjoyable, it's very fun because, um, I don't know, it's, it's, it's the beach. <laughs> and dinner. Dinner, it's very classical, as I said. And it's very romantic stuff uh, because you can talk, like for example, it's for couples who want to spend time together. Uh, bowling is more like for friends, for going with a friend's night. Um, cinema, it can also be with friends or with your partner. And it's very enjoyable too with both of situations. Um, I don't know, playing board games, it can be also with your partner or with your friends, it, it can be, it's, it's classical. Going to parties, I mean, it's more like for friends, actually it's for friends, but also it can be with your partner, you can go to a party with your partner, and it's very enjoyable, I, I guess. Uh, which two ways of celebrating St. Valentine's Day appeal to, to me most, and which two appeal least? Uh, I think, for example, going for dinner, it's a very good way of, of spending Valentine's Day. And also, um, going to the cinema or going to a party. And the, the two that I would, didn't really like very much, for example, uh, relaxing at home, I guess. You can go out, you can spend the day and some other stuff. Then staying at your home and playing board games, I guess it's a little um, boring for me. But uh, I also like it. I, I mean, I, I like both things. And well, I, I accept everything. I, I do like a lot of things. Well, uh, goodbye and thank you very much.